Baku Baku Animal, known only as Baku Baku in some regions, is a falling block puzzle game released for the Sega STB Arcade hardware. In this game you play as a zookeeper in a crazy kingdom, but you'd better watch out once you dive into the Baku Baku den, there's no turning back. To win, match each animal with its favourite food. As with any game of this type, the bigger the combo, the more chances you have of dumping stuff onto your opponent's screen. You can challenge the CPU or go head to head in 2 player mode. As you can see the game features beautiful 3D graphics and stunning colours for its time, bringing puzzling to the next level. It was kind of obvious we'd get a Sega Saturn port with the arcade game being on the STV arcade board, but we didn't just get a straight up port, oh no. The Japanese version has the arcade mode, 2 player mode and a very cool league mode. What's strange is that the league mode is missing from the western release unless you enter in the following code at the title screen. Press B A C up B A C up then start. I'm not sure about the western release but this Japanese version also offers a movie mode option which features a gold Sega logo animation and different sound options. Windows 95 port is a real pain to get working on a modern PC. It's also one of those games that require it is played in 256 color mode and in a tiny window. But is it worth the trouble of playing Baku Baku Animal on the PC? Absolutely not. This version I'm playing seems to be missing all of the cutscenes and arcade presentation, although they should be in the game because I saw the files on the game disc. The biggest problem though with this port is the constant pauses. Every time there's a change in the gameplay, the action pauses for a split second. This is extremely off-putting and really ruins the gameplay. <laughs> Baku Baku Animal on the Game Gear could be one of the best puzzle games on the system, which is saying a lot since the Game Gear has quite a few good puzzle titles. This features the original story mode found on the arcade version as well as a 2 player mode by linking two Game Gears together. 
Due to the Game Gear's low resolution, the playing field has been modified to allow more room for the player while the CPU is relegated to a small window to the right of the screen. This actually works out well for the player. I was expecting the CPU screen to be difficult to understand, but in reality, it's not. If there was one criticism with the Game Gear port, it would be that it can be quite easy compared to its big arcade brother. Released exclusively in Brazil, we have the Master System port. But don't get too excited because all Tech Toy has done is a simple hack of the Game Gear version to get it running on the Master System. It's pretty much the same game minus the two player option. It also has mono sound since the Master System can't produce stereo and features less color. Besides that, this is the Game Gear game. And let's take a look at all those versions of Baku Baku Animal running side by side. 